Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how to use PIC microcontroller. If you're new to this channel then please subscribe and turn on the bell icon to get the notification of new videos. Here I'm using a PIC16 F877A PIC microcontroller. The PIC16 F877A microcontroller is a popular 8-bit microcontroller from microchip. Features 5 I.O. ports. Port A, Port B, Port C, Port D, and Port E. Each port consists of multiple pins, which can be configured either as input or output, depending on the user's requirements. This is the pin diagram of PIC16 F877A. A breadboard. 20 MHz crystal oscillator. 22 pico farad capacitors. 5 mm LED. First placing the microcontroller on the breadboard. Then connecting pin 11 with breadboard positive terminal and pin 12 with breadboard negative terminal. Pin 31 with breadboard negative terminal. And pin 32 with breadboard positive terminal. Connecting crystal oscillator with pin 13 and 14. Then connecting 22 pico farad capacitors between the breadboard negative terminal and crystal oscillator. Then connecting a 10 kilo ohms resistor between pin 1 and the breadboard positive terminal. Then connecting a 5 mm LED between pin 34 which is pin 1 of port B to a 220 ohms resistor. Now to upload the program place the microcontroller and the trainer board. And connecting the board with the computer. Here we need two software. First Micro C Pro for writing programs and creating hex files. Second PIC Kit version 2 is used to upload hex files to the microcontroller. I've attached the download link for both software in the description. Now open Micro C Pro. Then create a new project. Entering project name, device model number, and frequency of crystal oscillator I'm using. S bit LED pin at RB1 bit that defines LED pin as pin 1 of port B. In the main function, tris b1 bit equals 0 which sets pin 1 of port b as output. Then in the while loop, led pin equals 1 will turn on the led. Delay MS500 which generates a delay of 500 milliseconds. LED pin equals 0 which turns off the LED. Delay MS500 which generates a delay of 500 milliseconds. Click on Build and Program to compile the code. Then click on this icon. Then save the hex file.
Now open the PicKit 2 software. First, erase the chip. Then import the hex file which was created in Micro C Pro. Then click on Write to upload the code. The code is successfully uploaded. Now providing 5 volt power to the breadboard. It's working properly. The light is blinking after 500 millisecond intervals. Thank you for watching the full video.